three months ago, my life could have ended. It's the truth. But I'm so grateful to be here tonight as well. I was on my way to another event, and Giselle recognized that I'm having a stroke. And let me just tell me right now in front of everyone, Giselle saved my life. Senator John Fetterman was hospitalized earlier this week after feeling lightheaded, reviving concerns about the Pennsylvania Democrats' health just one month into his Senate term. According to his office, Fetterman was hospitalized in Washington, D.C. after feeling faint. It's not yet clear what prompted the hospitalization, but doctors have said it wasn't caused by a stroke and that he's currently being monitored for a seizure. The incident comes after Fetterman suffered a stroke on the campaign trail in May 2022, prompted concerns that the Pennsylvania Democrat would not be fit to complete a six-year term in the Senate. Fetterman has maintained he is healthy enough to hold office and has not indicated any plans to resign. Well, I, I feel like we have been very transparent in a lot of different ways when our doctor has already given a letter saying that I'm able to serve and to, to be uh, running. Being on uh, in front of thousands and thousands of, of people and having interviews and getting around all across Pennsylvania, that gives everybody and the voters decide, you know, if they think that it's, it's really the issue. If Fetterman's health complications did prompt the senator to step down from office, a special process would be triggered in Pennsylvania. Democratic Governor Josh Shapiro would be tasked to appoint a replacement, though Shapiro would be likely to choose a Democrat, meaning the party doesn't have to worry about a shift in the balance of power in the upper chamber.